What is up, ladies and gentlemen? This is Jeff Benjamin with I Download Blog. Have you seen my home screen today? Look at it right now. You'll see something that's kind of peculiar. No app badges to speak of. Uh, it's kind of decluttered, if you will. That is because I have a brand new jailbreak tweak installed on my device called Conferro or Conferro, however you want to pronounce it. But this is a tweak that removes the app badges from your app icons. The little red badges that show you how many notifications you have waiting on you um, that are normally in the upper right hand corner of each app icon. Those are no longer displayed courtesy of this jailbreak tweak. So you may be asking yourself, well, Jeff, how do you know which apps have notifications waiting? Well, all you do is you tap the little Conferro app icon or the little status bar icon rather in the upper right hand corner in your status bar so you see it right next to the location icon I just tap it like this and there is the conferro interface the little overlay and you can see I have two apps with notifications I have Gmail and I have messages messages has two notifications and Gmail has well, 167 emails that I need to check there uh, and of course any app that has notifications will appear here so this will just fill up with additional apps as more notifications come in and you can do some really cool things with this tweak I'm gonna show you in the settings let's go over to our settings app and let's scroll down and you'll see the conferral preference panel and it's a really really well laid out uh, preference panel for this tweak. Notice number one, I've never seen anything like this before, but notice, look at the conferral little header there. See how it's kind of like faded out. There's a little animation right there from within the settings for the header. Uh, that is really cool. I've never seen a, a tweak developer do that before. If you've seen something like that, please leave me a comment. Let me know which tweak does it because it's a first for me. Um, so this is the conferral interface. It looks super clean, super simple, but actually it's kind of deep. Uh, all you do is you enable the tweak if it's not already and then you go to your configuration section and there you'll find the various settings and there's quite a few settings here to be found um, you have light mode so you can change up the uh, display right now it's set to dark mode let me just show you what I mean so I tap and there's the dark mode for conferral now watch what happens when I switch over to light I'm gonna just tap and see see it's light now so not you know anything huge but it's a nice option now normally with conferral you can swipe on an app icon in the uh, conferral overlay and remove it uh, from conferral you can close it out but now you can actually when you enable the use close box you can actually tap and hold on an app icon to bring up the little close box and close that way so so I'm going to show you what I mean here you just you just tap and hold and you get the little close box you can hit the X to dismiss the app if you want to do it that way but I'm gonna turn off the use close box and here's what you get when you tap and hold on it like this you get do you want to clear all notification badges okay cancel if you want to do that or if you prefer you can just swipe like that to clear it out just like that uh, so those are some options that you have for clearing your notification badges you also have allow paging so you can set up paging to scroll through your list of apps see that little dot there uh, which indicates you have one page and you can scroll when you have more app icons to fill up that page um, so I'll turn that off you also have hide app badge which is on uh, if you want to turn that off that means you'll display all the app badges on the home screen but you have to respring in order to do that uh, so we're going to keep that on for now now there's this other little section called indeterminate badge um, and this is a little interesting basically it hides the badges on your home screen but it places a little sliver of the badge without the number of notifications waiting that allows you to see well this app does have notifications I'm not sure how many until uh, I actually opened the app uh, but you can see on your home screen on the springboard itself which apps have notifications but it's very very minimal it's just a sliver of the app badge I'm actually going to show that to you here in a second so hang with me because we need to respring to do that there's also uh, the switcher so you can actually turn conferro into an app switcher if you want to do that there's an activator gesture that you can use to invoke conferral and there's also security that you can use to set up a passcode for uh, securing conferral as well if you want to do that or you can use touch ID for that matter but let me show you the switcher I'm gonna double press the home button here and you can see this is the app switcher right now so I can actually switch apps using conferral just by using a double press of the home button and here's the app switcher so I can switch between apps just like this uh, go back and forth um, so that's kind of cool not a 
you know, I'm not a huge fan of using the app switcher like that. I prefer just to use it normally with Conferro and access the apps that have notifications just like that. And of course, like I said, you can set up an activator gesture if you want to set up an activator gesture to invoke Conferro so you don't have to actually tap on that little little uh, icon in the status bar, which is kind of hard to tap because it's so small. You saw me struggling to tap it a few times probably. Um, so yeah, this is a uh, conferral. Now I want to show you the indeterminate badge. So that is going to require a respring. So just bear with me for a second. Okay, so I'm back. I've resprung, and you can see on the Gmail app and on the Messages app, you see the indeterminate badge. So you see a little sliver of a badge in the upper right-hand corner. You don't see how many actual notifications are waiting, uh, but you do get notified that there are notifications, at least one, waiting on you because of that badge, that little sliver of a badge. And it looks really good. I like that. The only problem with this is that when you actually open up the conferral interface using the little status bar icon, um, yeah, those are indeterminate badges as well. So it would have been nice if, you know, you would have had an indeterminate badge on the home screen, but then could have opened up the conferral interface and saw the actual number of notifications waiting for each app. But as it stands, there's indeterminate badges in both sections, which really just doesn't make that much sense to me. Like the whole point, in my opinion, would be to use indeterminate badges on the home screen and then be able to open up the conferral interface and then see the uh, full amount of notifications there. But with this way, you actually still have to open up the full app uh, to view those badges. So there really is almost no reason to use conferral, except for the fact that you want to see all the apps that have some sort of notifications in one place. Uh, so that still is an advantage there. But again, folks, conferral, it is a really cool jailbreak tweak. It does something different than any tweak I've ever seen. Um, it allows you to really clean up and tidy up the home screen and get rid of all the badges and still access all your badges in one handy location using a little status bar uh, icon in the upper right hand corner of your status bar or by means of an active gesture. So folks, let me know what you guys think about Conferral down below in the comment section. It is $1.50 on CDS Big Boss Repo. It does require iOS 8 and is compatible with the iPhone 5 through the iPhone 6 Plus. Not so much with the iPad just yet, but wait for it because that should be coming down the pipeline as well. Again, folks, it is Conferral. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.